This does not hold on. It's Monroe, the calculator company. Monroe LI or something like that, or II or something. Anyway, I got this calculator at an estate sale for $8. Yeah, I saw it. I thought it was cool looking. Late 70s, early 80s design or whatever, and that kind of looked like that. But I wasn't really going to get it. Um, but then I went to go ahead and plug it in and see how it worked. And guess what I found out? It uses Nixie tubes. The instance I saw the thing used Nixie tubes, I just had to, I just had to get it. I just had to. So I got it. Look at that. It uses the Nixie tubes for the display. Let's try this. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Plus three equals six, five, four, three, two, four. Point zero, 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 zero. This is so cool. It, okay, it's 13 digits. Now, if you do too much, say you put another 8 or just do something to go past there, it'll light up a neon light for overflow. That would be clear. Although, something, this is a kind of calculator, not the regular calculator, but some kind of, I don't know if it's for it. You know, it has the plus and minus equals on the same key and stuff. Kind of weird. I tried, like, doing some minusing things. Which just, well, that time it worked, but still, I had some weird ways earlier. I don't know if I'm just doing it wrong or what. Also, if anybody knows what this is, this little dial here with these numbers on it. I do not know what this is for. Nor do I know what this 5 fourth thing is for. Or what all these RV stuff are for. Or this K. Or things like that. Or that little diamond. Or that star thing. But it's really neat. Really cool calculator. Common integrated circuit. It's a 741 operational amplifier. I have so many of those. It's unbelievable. That's with the 55. And the 36. I, mean, I love the Nixie tubes. I love the Nixie tubes. Some numbers appear to be jutting out farther than others. Well, they are. That's how Nixie tubes are. They're layered. Now I'll be taking looks for the inside of this calculon. Here's the top cover. The vent place where the overflow light goes, a wire going to the thing to keep it grounding ways or whatever shielding. Now, oh, wow. look at the inside there. The board where the Nixie tubes are mounted on is an overflow neon light. There's a transformer. There's it where the plug goes on. Fuse, capacitors, power transistor. I'm guessing that's probably the part that runs the neon lights and the Nixie tubes. Turn the thing on. I wonder what causes the Nixie tubes really don't all come on at once. They like mostly come on and then some might take it like come on it. Turn the light off there, it's see it better now. Oh, it's too bright, you can barely see it. It says three three two five four two. 
This is so cool. They're still good. I would like to be able to um, get some more markers, especially some black ones and